Hello guys, on this channel we are going to start with what you should do before you create your first program or before you write code. We have four steps. The, number one is to identify the problem. Number two is to identify the user. Number three is to determine your target computer. Number four is to determine your programming skill. We are going to look at each one of the steps. Number one is to identify the problem. Every program solves a problem, so you should state clearly the problem so that you can create the best program. For example, if you have been approached by a wholesale store, they are asking you if they have, they want a program that will print products on sale on the screen or print new products. You should uh, write something like uh, writing a program that prints product on sale. You should name the product like milk oil on the screen. Number two is to identify the user. If you're not the one using the program, you should identify the person using the program so that you can create something that uh, it's a user friendly and also someone who has knowledge on program. Determine your target computer. You should be able to know which type of machine the users are using. Don't use something that is not cannot be used by the users. If the users are using Windows, create a program with Windows. Don't use Linux. Determine your programming skills. Know which part of the program that you're going to work with. If uh, you, you're not the only one going to create the program, if there are, um, you're going to, to create a part of the program and the others are going to create the other part, use a system that is easily known to other people who are going to, to help you in creating the system. After all that, you should be able to know the aim and the objective. When you talk about the aim, you're talking about the goals that need to be achieved. Aim, for example, is to write a program that prints product on sale on the screen. So create, write the objective clear. There are two essential tools in computer programming. One is algorithm, which means step. The other one is flowchart, which talks about the graphics representation of the program. So we're going to talk about these two in our next video. Thank you. Make sure you subscribe and like.